Howdy, Eli. Huh. Didn't realize we were gonna be so corporate structury. Wow, I'm not even high. What's new? Okay, so we got the name, we got the home base, we got the logo. So that means next step is to find people that can shoot guns? No. Uh, so that means next step is to make connections with people that can shoot guns. Oh, come on, man. We want this thing to be more than a street gang. We want to be an organization, an institution. And that means we need to have our fingers in more pies. You got an idea where to start? As a matter of fact, I do. Okay, everyone's action item is to reach out to their contacts and see what new business opportunities you can find for the Saints. Shit. My contacts all got their own things going already. What about JR? Your partner's on his garage, right? Maybe he'll go all in with the Saints? No harm in asking. Great. What about you, Nina? I can't talk to any of my old Panteros contacts. But I do know some people who did business with them. I'm sure I can persuade them to do business with us instead. Nice. Kevin. <laughs> you want contacts? I got contacts, baby. Okay, go be superstars. Meantime, I'm gonna finish going through that briefcase we got from John Bland. That thing's a treasure trove, let me tell you. Everyone, keep me posted on your progress. <laughs> J.R., how'd you like to be a part of something big? My friends and I are starting a new venture. Sounds awful nice, but our current venture's in trouble. Those Panteros are cutting into our profits something fierce. I'll tell you what. Join our new thing, and no one's ever gonna mess with this garage again. Well, you take care of this Panteros problem, and I'll consider it. Deal. There was Body by TV Noise and myself featuring Big Frida. Hey, this is Dylan Francis, and you're listening to The Drop on KXBPM 95. So fulfill what your fist pumping heart desires. You're listening yep. to The Drop. So, how are these Panteros fucking with our business? You name it. Undercutting costs, scaring off our customers. Sergio said this jacked up mountain of a dude named Derek to run me out of business any way and every way he can. Take care of his toughs in the park. Maybe you'll scare him enough to go mess with someone else. Say no more. Jim Rob's garage is off limits. Show your face there again, you're dead. The old man sent you? You mess with JR? You mess with us. Ah. Protect what's ours. Oh. Howdy. 
Hey, JR. I took care of the crew in the park. Well, I'll be. Let's go after their supply lines next. Derek's got a crew at the train depot smuggling in crates of stolen parts. That's how they keep undercutting my prices. Don't worry. I got this. Feel free to blow up their cars, too. Panteros get real bugged by that. Hey, Eli. I'm fixing up a Pantero's problem for JR. Then I think he's in. How's the rest of the team doing? Great. Kevin knows so many people. <laughs> Reagan, all he has to do is buy him coffee to get him to sign on. Well, I'm busting my ass torching Pantero's cars. Come on. You know you love it. I really do. This ain't your territory, dumbass! It is now! You fuck with Jim Rob, you answer to the Saints! Down for the count! Sergio, Jim Rob's garage is under the safe protection. Jim Rob's. Two for two, JR. Son of a gun, you still got it. Only thing left to hit is Derek's HQ. He's down in the corner. Oh, hell's bells. You gotta get back here. Derek and his crew just rolled up on me. This is what you get for fighting back, old man. You get off of my land. Fuck, better hurry. Enough! They deserve. 
deserve that. Say this one last time. Stay away from JR. That settles Derek and his crew. Right thoughtful of him to bring the fight to us. So, what should I tell my friends? Are you in? I'm in. What do you call this new outfit? We're the Saints. Welcome aboard. Well, we can count JR in. Uh, what is this? It's not board game night. No, this is where all our dreams come true. Don't say that. My dreams are pretty weird. While you were out talking to JR, I was going through the briefcase we got from John Bland, the real estate guy. Turns out the deeds of the church wasn't the only thing in there. As of now, we are the proud owners of a shit ton of empty lots all across town. That's real estate we can use to start up some new, um, entrepreneurial ventures. By which he means crimes. Fine, yes, crimes. Nice. You did say we need to have our fingers in more pies. I've got that covered. I spent the whole day baking my ass off. Okay, fine. They're empanadas. That's not a pie. It's in the pie family. Now I'm really...
really hungry. Plan first, eat later. Right. So, how do we cover all this ground? One building at a time. So far, we've got the church... And Jim Robs. So what do we build next? Whatever we want. All right, so here's the plan. We open a monster taqueria and call it Chalupa Cabra. But we don't just sell food. We take over the entire drug distribution network in Santo Ileso. Here, it's all about the food trucks. My friend Chuy knows the business inside and out. And he makes a killer michelada. He'll show you how it works. All the traffic in town moves through four trucks. Weenie, Twisty, Sammy, and the King. Nothing a few rockets and a Molotov can't fix. True. Or we could steal each truck and all its product and put it to work for us. Even better. Where do these guys roll? I've got Jimmy following the King right now. I'll put you in touch. If the cops roll...
I'm so good, I surprised myself. It's gonna be different. As long as he keeps paying the bills. My anti air is work. Hey, it's uh Jimmy, right? Yeah. Good to see you, boss. What's the king moving today? Lower dust. They just re up, so the truck's full. You see any muscle? Maybe a dozen guys, a few cars. I'll take it from here. Go see if Chewie needs help. I'm in mergers and acquisitions. Here we go. Down for the count. Home with Mama.
there. is a doornail. Hey, Chewie, I'm driving home with the king. Oh, yeah. That's Lakeshore money. All those bankers and brokers are gonna make us rich. So good, I surprised myself. Okay, boss. Bring in the king and finish his crew. We gotta lock this place down tight. Oh. Should have stayed home with mom.
That's right. Who wears a crown now, king? <laughs>